even after I said I should save, and I just just check, I don't. I I think I'm fine. Yep, 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 yep. So that was that was all for naught. All for an optional boss. But I, I didn't even put material on my party members. That was uh very stupid of me. But these things happen when you try to, to rush Chivos. Oh my god. My um my fast forward is binded to um the same trigger button that um brings up the, the different Yeah. So when I was trying to avoid Gongaga it drove me directly into it. So let's just uh not do that then. The goal is to do this as quickly as possible then. No, no fucking around. Fuck, right in front of it. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, breakdown. Oh my god. Oh. I'm familiar with it. It's like you lied, you can't come in. Fuck off. Dick breath. God damn it, now I've got to do the whole Barrett thing again. I have to do this one from the save point anyway. Let me see if I can try the, the different um the different save thing that I have on disc two. Those two? Oh no, I, I can leave them there. Um, oh, 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 yep. Okay. Um, we exit and we load up a different disk.
you. You. I'm wondering if there's like a way that I can just piss off Aries, Yuffie, and um, Tifa. Just piss them off, piss them off, do, 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 reject them or something. I don't think there is though. Woodlands area? No, I think all of this is still like. I think we need to go to slot two. Forgotten capital, yeah, high school. Um, medial area. But, okay, 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 okay. Like, Cloud is in our, our party at all times. Until he's not, for a small period of this too. So I'm guessing like he's back for good at this stage here. And if I go from here. Let's just check the strat strategy wiki. Walk through. Because why would I be back at June on? This feels like the save. This one here. This feels like it's it. Oh, okay, so I'm in the Junon area, and... Right, I guess we've got the, the Phoenix. No, no, no. No, no, we, we'd have Phoenix, wouldn't we? Someone's got Phoenix. There we are. Yeah. Okay, okay, so we need to get back to, um, do we have the airship? Yes, okay. We go to Medeal. close if possible and we initiate the encounter with uh, the ultimate weapon but we need to visit cloud oh this is not him oh give me that shit Yeah, don't worry, they're probably gonna die. Oh shit. Hmm. Honestly, it's the best policy. It's what they're telling kids, and I like that moral... That moral story. Okay, now... It's got to be something here that I missed.
do we just have to repeatedly talk to him? Yep. Fuck. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, you see that? Saying oh, yes. The fuck, bruh? Miss me with this shit. Um Is there a way that I can avoid all that grinding? I'm now looking at a guide. Let me. We can look over it together. At least we got one Final Fantasy VII Shivo, yeah? That's pretty sick. And, and all I had to do was speak to Cloud at like one more time. Disgusting Achivo. <laughs> Disgusting Achivo. Okay. Now, this is the one. Perhaps there's like uh, another one. Like obviously, um, Cosmo Canyon is the best place to spam it. But is there like another one where we can like uh, manipulate this? Hmm. Yeah, Cosmo Canyon. When you finally, yeah. Man. Gongaga. Cosmo Canyon, yeah, there's not much after that, okay, but I am glad that I was able to find, is it here, yeah, there we go. So 24th of March, 2023, the last Chivo was in August, 22nd of August, 2022. Is that like almost six months? So August, September, October, November, December, and from March. Oh, it's eight months. Holy shit. Over eight months. Mm. Oh, by the way, this particular um, achievement, another disgusting one. Because of what it implies. Like, defeat both forms of Sethroth at full power. If you really go into the nitty gritty of what at full power means, you, you soon learn, like, oh, geez, this is, this is disgusting. I wonder if we got some tips in here, or if it just says, like, just abuse the, um... Right. Yeah. You can avoid crushing buggy. Just stop it before, um, before cannon, canyon. Ah, oh, Cosmo Canyon, and walk there. It's mandatory for Fort Condor fights Chivo, huh? Yeah. Well, anyways, that that's like a whole nother kettle of fish. Anyways, let's 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 try for the um. The Barra dating one again. We have to go through that whole rigmarole again, but I promise I'll just fast forward as, as much as possible. I, I, mm, do I want to go for the Kate Sith one? Nah. Nah. Uh, so. 
you kind of have to do a full reset because you have to swap it over to a different disc. History disc one. Yay. Let's change the, uh, the Chivo count as well. Boo 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 boo. Hmm. It's weird being um back on Final Fantasy Seven to be honest with you. It really is weird. I'll probably um stream again tomorrow. Um but the main objective for tonight is to to get this Barrett date um Chivo going. Continue. Uh, two. Right, it was this one. So if we go back, did I do anything here that's like extra? No. Okay. I was tr I was trying to see if there's anything close. There's there's nothing, guys. There's nothing. It's unfortunate. Oh, are you kidding me? Pinsid. Disgusting. Low level run is going to be a treat. Such a treat. Okay. Hey Devkin, how are you? We uh we did the Iron Sword achievement for the Nintendo. And now we're doing some Chivo cleanup um, tonight in Final Fantasy VII. What have you been doing lately, though? Let's let's get a shout out going. Days gone. Okay, interesting. I remember. I think the last time you were playing some Raft. You, you keep it nice and varied for your audience, that's pretty good. Me, I'm, I'm very selfish. I'll usually stream what I want to stream, but um, if someone claims something, then I'll play something else. But... Yes, hope that you are well. I am no longer salty. I've done the Iron Sword achievement, so now I'm keeping my rage in check. So, as you probably recall, because you, you were following me um, during the Final Fantasy 7 days, we completed this, I don't know, about 8 months ago, and we still had some achievements on the, the set left to do, and I said oh, I'll get to them later. Well, because I've gotten to Metal Gear and Iron Sword, and I don't want to get to Mega Man just yet, thought that we would um do this one okay I reckon talking to Barrett like 30 times using this glitch would be enough so we're gonna do that and we're gonna save this time because uh, I messed up I went to the um, 
we got all the way to Nibelheim, the Shinra Mansion, and we fought the optional boss Lost Number, and I was severely under-equipped. I didn't transfer materia between crew members, and we got slaughtered, unfortunately. So, very disheartening. Very disheartening. Um, Resident Evil 4 Remake has dropped. A lot of people on Twitch are having fun with that. Um, to be honest, from what I saw, I thought, okay, kind of interesting, but... Like, how is this so much better than the original Resident Evil 4? Like, the original Resident Evil 4, I didn't feel like it looked too different from the remake. And I just thought, mm, Why not just, uh play the original. I don't know. It's like people that played the Final Fantasy 7 remake and swear by it. I'm like, mm, give me this any day of the week. Okay, that's five times. There's an achievement where we have to go on a date with Barrett in the Golden Saucer. And we're exploiting something here, so... Apparently if you, if you talk to him favorably during these two options, um, it's three points of affection each. But this whole, like, scripted scene is bugged, I guess. Because it allows you to, um exit out on the second one and then to repeat the loop so we can get like uh, affection points infinitely which is very good for me because I don't want to waste my time with this game thank you thank you um it wasn't the pop that I wanted like, I wanted the Barrett Date pop, but we did get the Xenogears pop. The, Z the Xenogears pop uh, turned out to be surprisingly easy to get. But, um... Yeah. It's not worth a lot of points. It's, like, worth uh, two points. But, I mean, like, I'll take it. It's it's all progress towards the badge. We, we're inching closer and closer. But the painful ones are gonna be, um... Doing four Condor manually for all 15 possible battles and doing a low level run. The low level run's gonna suck the life out of me, but. Yep, yeah, inchworm style. But we're getting closer. But you know what um, I saw recently? Um, there's gonna be a revision for Final Fantasy VIII. And I was just like, oh. Like, it's, it's gonna happen with these, like, like, coveted JRPGs. Like, you, generationally, the, there, are fa there are fans of these games, and we're gonna keep getting, like, these mega fans. And the devs, they just, they, they wanna put their name up in lights. They want their name there on the badge set. And we're gonna continue to get these revisions. So then it's like, you know... Do I want to continue to go back to the badge? It's like I, I've mastered I've mastered it five times, you know. Like some of these um, sets, they just keep going back to the well. I I really do feel that um, RA they need to have like a system where people vote on a set and they say this set is perfect because we say this set is perfect now. Let's lock it for a year. Like, from all revision. Just lock it. It's been voted as perfect by the community. If after a year we come back, we'll do another vote. Is this set um, perfect? If the thing is like, yes, lock it for another year. Some sets, they do not need revisions. They are simply perfect. So don't touch them. Now, if, if you've got a dev that's like, oh, I want to make some minor tweaks, minor, um, what do you call them? Like, um, 
Not, not immersion. Like, um... Something of life. Comfort of life. Um, if you make changes to the badge that are like, okay, this is like a slightly better version of what we had before. I could see that happening. I could see that going through and, and adding to a so-called perfect set. You know, like a, a pop-up to let you know that um, a missable is about to be, you know. I, I don't know. I just feel like um, with some of these sets for quote-unquote legendary games, please don't touch them. Like they've already been fucking molested by like multiple dads before you. And what I really dislike, usually when a revision goes through, the newer dev gets most of the credit, and the previous dev, like, they get shunted. Yeah. There doesn't seem to be a lot of, like, history of the set, kind of. Maybe there is, like, if I really dig into a set, maybe it's got, like, you know, how a set was made and, and the changes that were made to a set. I don't know. Maybe I'm not looking hard enough. We've, we've talked about it 12 times, so we need to talk to him at least 30. So buckle up. We're gonna talk to him 35 times just to get over 100 uh, affection points. And then after I do this, I'm gonna save it. Uh, I'll save it in Nibelheim. What have you been badging uh, lately, Kailuya? I think I've seen you, like, on the RA list. I think you did badge something recently. I'm not sure if it was Mario related. I don't know, JR did something Mario related. I think that you did something else. And I also heard that you, um, like, someone in your family has COVID. So I hope that they uh, recover from that speedily. Oh, okay, uh, SMB3 hack. I really do need to start doing some SMB. Like, I haven't touched them, but one day they'll be um, redeemed, I reckon. I'm working on fairly odd parents break into rules. I'm not sure if that's, the, that's a game. <laughs> It it seem it, it it feels familiar to me. Break into rules. Yeah. Oh. PS2. Okay. I I personally I want to keep away from the PS2 um, sets until I've done a lot more of the um the older school ones. Like a lot, I feel like a lot of the established retro crowd they're like. Okay, yeah, 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 it's time for PS2. For me, it's like, hey, 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 I, I just got here. Like, I'm, I'm fully prepared to do lots of Nintendo stuff, guys. All over the board. There's nothing wrong with that. Like, I think it's best to go for whatever you want. Like, if you've got an eye on a particular badge, or you just want to try a particular game, then just do it. Just do it. Just do it. That's 15 times. Oh, it's a lot of gig sweat on my, um, my glasses. My glasses. Two seconds, I've got to... Can I do it here? I don't want to... Okay. That kind of works. 